All right, before we start this video, if you even consider Martin Luther King a revolutionary, compared to all of the other black revolutionaries we had, such as Malcolm X, Khalid Muhammad, Marcus Garvey, Martin Luther King don't have shit on them. Now, I'm not here to bash a black man or nothing like that, but this has to be exposed. So without further ado, let's get into this. So we will march for freedom. We will march for equality. Because we have been fighting far too long. I don't care what they do. We will not stoop down to their level. I don't care if they punch us. I don't care if they yell in our face. I don't care if they push us. I don't care if they spit on us. Spit, spit on who? What you mean? You. Who? What? You. <laughs> Nigga, you lost your mind. Ain't nobody <gasps> spitting on me. Talk to Dr. King like that. I'm sorry, ain't nobody spitting on me. Stop, Stop that his speech. Stop. Yes, you will. In the name of freedom. Bro, listen. If you think I'm going to let a nigga named Jacob spit on me. Young man. Like, bro, you tripping. Hey, you listen here. I march for my freedom. When I was punched, I marched. I was smacked with a brick on the back of my neck, and I marched. People was yelling in my face, and I marched. Now you tell me what you call that. A pussy. Oh, wow. I, would, I would call you a pussy. Like, Young I'm man. Sorry, bro. Motherfuckers Young. running around here posting Martin Luther King, Martin Luther King. Nigga, fuck that nigga. He was a sellout. Duh. Come around here with your fuck shit, nigga. I'm that's a mass so. nigga, if that's the case, nigga. Fuck Martin Luther King, though. That nigga was a straight whole cake, nigga. Letting little kids Damn. get... Washed up by water holes, bitten by dogs and shit. And y'all niggas want to praise a bitch ass nigga like that? Non violent ass nigga like that, bitch? I'm so I don't give a fuck who don't like it. Fuck you, Christians, too, nigga. Facts, bro. Then on top of that, this nigga cheated on his wife, Coretta Scott King, with more than 40 women who are not black, by the way. As you clearly can see, the first picture I showed you, them nigga, that nigga was a sellout, bro. That nigga was a sellout, bro. And at the end of his life, he even said that he felt like he was putting his people in the burning building, my nigga. The story is, white people was not killing grown-ass black people like that, unless you was a business owner. They was mostly attacking and killing our youth. And Martin Luther, bitch-ass, pussy nigga king, convinced black people to be nonviolent. And I'm like, dog, shit like that, it's time to go to war. Straight up, it's time to go to war. Slaughter gang. And run through. I would have ran through. If I'd have been alive back then, I would have blew Martin Luther King away in front of everybody, and I would have told my people, "Get, get everything you got. If you ain't strapped, get your kitchen knife. If you ain't got a kitchen knife, bitch, get a kitchen pot. Cause we gonna find these motherfuckers that did that. That's a fact. And so my thing is today, we really need to be celebrating right here, Khalid Muhammad. You feel me, and Malcolm X. During Black History Month in school, they don't teach you about these two black figures or revolutionaries because. They was with Ward. They wasn't passive. They wasn't on no sweet shit like MLK. And they damn sure wasn't they damn sure wasn't playing no games, you feel me? But that's just the end of the video. I just wanted to let y'all know that shit, bro.